Now there's a familiar face. Uh, uh, hey. Fancy meeting you here. Yeah, crazy how long it took for us to cross paths since the event started. So, how's the Guildmaster life treating you, Flames? It's... it's been good. Uh, guys, I'd like you to meet the cast of Dreams. Saturn Diva, Snow Whitey, and Astrologist. These are some of my new guild members. Uh, introduce yourselves. Nice to meet you. I I'm Alphonse. So nice to meet you all for the first time. Big fan, big fan. Hi, Snowy. Hi, Curb. Casto Dreams. Is that a reference? It is, yes. Good on you for being old enough to catch that. Pleasure to make your acquaintances. Uh, forgive us for being a member shorter than usual. I was about to say, where's our favorite attack drone at? Hold everything! Ah, oh, don't mind me. My gat was doing some cleanup on aisle three back there. What did I miss? Introductions! I'm the second in command. Which I suppose makes me the brains of this outfit. Though, I'm sure that must be making your fearless leader roll her eyes off into the stratosphere. Hey. Only I get to sarcastically call her that. So, I take it you used to be a part of their guild. I was, yes. We were sad to see her go, but I'm sure she's doing a great job. You guys are very generous to be helping her out. Pardon my common sense, kids, but there's been a treasure box in front of like 20 people for the last 20 seconds with not a single one of us opening it. Hello? By my observation, we got here at just about the same time, didn't we? I'd say so. So, what say we make a little bet for it? Four on four match, winning team gets whatever's inside. Or I could just tap a button, open it, and take it. Would you do that? If it's a statue. Go ahead. You need it, right? <sighs> oh, it's the dreaded dot dot dot! You're on. Uh oh, okay. Don't consult us or anything. Yeah, whatever. I would have said yes. Splendid. Yay! Mm. Hmm. Let's not waste any time, gentlemen and ladies. Old Flame Girl deserves full force. Um, what was that? That would be a team attack. New addition to the game since the campaign started. Takes up both players' turns, but usually results in something pretty hefty. Oh, Nino! That all you got? Your cast seems a little flimsy in the performance today. It's only the first act. Just wait.
that's that. It's a relic! And a nice hunk of cash! How about that? Well, I'd say we're done here. Only got a couple days left to track down two more. And then we get our ticket to a buttload of actual cash. <sighs> oh dear. That was a significantly angry dot dot dot. I'm gonna be real with you, Flames. 10,000 bucks for yourself from the final cut? It's a miracle you've got five members. Hey, come on. You fought fair and square. I just gotta rub it in just because you won. Uh, dude, not a good time. It's still more members than you, for one thing. Well, we might have some more joining soon. Quantity's one thing, but we're going to win this in the end. Look, you can keep on saying that, but which side of this equation is a pack of ghosts right now? You're not willing to share the wealth, and your guild's never going to have the cooperation needed to come out on top. Let's get out of here. Yeesh! Could cut that tension with a knife. Wait! Uh, n nice meeting you all. Ta-ta! Um, if it means anything, she talked about if we win, you're still welcome to join the celebration. I, uh, I appreciate the thought. Thanks. Take care, Stephanie. Ew. Should we go? Let's just head back to the village, check in with Nylock, and then I'll probably call it a day. Don't worry. We'll do better next time. Yeah, Hattie's right. I appreciate it. Sorry, guys. It's whatever. Oh, huh. So if you warp back to the hub when your party's been wiped out, you go here? Yeah, it's got a healing station for tossing you right back in. I shot Nylock a message to come meet us at the town square. Follow me. Town square? Uh, which one? There's squares and cubes all over this place, right? That was really good. A plus. Sorry. No, it's fine. I know you're only trying to lighten the mood. I didn't want to make a big scene back there, just... You know. Are you gonna be okay? Yeah, don't worry about it. I know we're still friends. The cast of dreams are all good folks, but they're competition at the end of the day, so... It's complicated. Either way, we're four days in and still no relics collected. I may have to pull some all-nighters and search on my own if I need to. Uh, I don't think I've got anything else going on over the next couple of days. I could chip in if you need it. Worst come to worst, we may have to skip out on this first event. No way. If we've got two and a half full days, I'm getting us entered. It's still an opportunity. Plus, this one could feasibly be the easiest way in. The other three competitions might be even harder. Yeah, true enough. We'll figure it out. Maybe our luck will change? Hark! I... Nylock, dragon of returning with good news! Have managed to secure an ancient relic of the Shadow Beast! Oh, dude, that's great! You're a lifesaver! Think nothing of it, Guildmaster. Tis only a simple duty as Knight of the Dandy Alliance. What rewards did thine adventure through the Jacksoni jungle benefit? Not much. We came close to getting a second one, but some, uh, old friends made things complicated. Lots of quotation marks. Oh dear, my apologies, friends. But the day is still young. Yeah, and I gotta make use of the rest of it. So I'm gonna grab a quick break and then probably explore some more sectors tonight. You guys are welcome to keep looking around, or you can take it easy for the day. I'll understand if you want to call it. Alpha, what say you and I romp around for a bit, huh? Sure, and hey, don't stress out too much about this whole thing, okay? This is nothing. If I crumbled over one loss, I'd be no leader. I'll see you around, guys. Oof. Anyway, we're gonna head off. Nye, Patty, have a good one. I'll make sure to do a better job tomorrow. Yeah, we all will. Fare thee well, squires. Look to a brighter tomorrow, as I'm sure a horizon of hope shall rise with the dawn.
sure hope everyone's remembering to wear their masks and also to wash their hands. Dude, okay, I can take a hint. I'll be more careful, I promise. Never hurts to be reminded. You guys know anything about a place called Ludius Labyrinth? It's a forest out in the Adodes Woods region. There's some pretty tough monsters there, like this one that starts out as a little worm and then transforms into a killer moth. That's not even the worst part. Deeper into the forest is a maze, where one wrong turn can send you back to the beginning. If you don't pick the right path, you'll just be lost for hours. Rumor has it. <laughs> That there's both a main path and a secret path through the maze. If you can find the secret path, there'll be treasure waiting for you. I'll take your word for it. Excuse me, do you know of any other areas around Adatus Woods where I can find more of those relics? If I knew that, I'd be going after them myself. Fair warning though, there's supposed to be 300 of them in total, but some of them are fake. They'll even come to life and attack you as a mini-boss. Pray you don't find one of those. Thanks. Hey guys, question. Since you don't level up in this game like in other RPGs, how do I learn new special attacks? Have you been to any of the hub towns yet? In each one there's a dojo building where you can learn new techniques. But to do so, you'll have to beat the dojo master in a one-on-one -on -one fight. They're pretty tough, but I'd say the one in Edotus Woods is the easiest. Start there. Will do. Ah, welcome, young squire. Art thou ready for our next adventure? You bet. Excellent. Before we embark, I... Nylock, master, master of bestowing, bestowing crucial information, information! Shall explain to thee each of the important locales that decorate the hub towns, found across the terrain of magical expertise. Come! Whoosh! First stop, the training dojo. Tis here that an ancient and powerful master can instruct thee in learning a potent new technique with which ye can use for combat. Thou must defeat the master of this dojo in order to gain their immense knowledge. Here we have the item shop. Within its walls are merchants selling consumable goods and powerful enhancers with which to aid thee in thine travels. In addition, Mobile merchants may be discovered across the lands when in a tight spot. Next, the battle arena. When the many soldiers of Tome are between accomplishing feats of heroism, they are here, showing their martial prowess to adoring spectators as they clash with burning intensity. Fame and fortune alike can be achieved here. Yonder is the graveyard. When thine party falls in battle, they are transported back to this location to be restored to the living and fight another day! Finally, these magical telepillars are enchanted with the magical web of light that shall whisk ye away to wherever ye desire. The telepillar at the farthest end of the village shall take thee to the stronghold, ruled over by the godly net king of the Adotus Woods, Chief Bitopio! Now, if thou wishes to acquire any important items and equipment before setting off, or if thou would like to challenge the village's dojo master to learn a new technique, take thy time. Otherwise, let us begin our mission to conquer the dreaded Luteus Labyrinth! Hello there, little one! Welcome to the Adodis Woods Martial Arts Dojo. I'm the master of this here establishment, Bolamore. Let me know how I can help you to become stronger. Certainly! This old dog loves teaching young up-and-comers some new tricks. <laughs> I'll grot your temporary mastery of all my techniques for this mock battle so you can see which one you like. <laughs> Let's...
Welcome, little one. What'll it be? All right, then. I treat all warriors with the same respect, so I won't be holding back now. Prepare yourself. <laughs> All right, that's the stuff, little one. Now, how's about I teach you a new special technique as a reward? Choose the one you want, and I'll make it so. A oh, fine choice, little one. I hope this serves you well out in the field of battle. Come back here if you ever want to work out and test your new moves. Good luck to you. Hark! Our quest to obtain the elusive relics of the Shadow Beast continue! Luteus Labyrinth, Sector M! We ride! Our heroes arrive, surrounded on every side by fungus the size of imposing trees. The knight takes the first step forward, accompanied by his ever-diligent squire. The road is paved with danger. But will their destination yield victory or despair? Oh, dear me, how could I? Nylock, dragon, dragon of, of foolish, foolish forgetfulness. forgetfulness! Have forgotten to ask such an important question. The excitement of our quest must have distracted me so. Squire, do tell. Does thou know the history of this sacred land of Tome? Might this knight share with ye the tale of the terrain of magical expertise? Yes, please. Oh, fructuous day! <clears throat> Pardon my giddiness. Tis not often such a joyous opportunity presents itself. I... Nylock, master, master of, of harrowing, harrowing history. history! Shall giveth thee the abridged version, as it were. Eons ago, a group of five spiritualists with incredible powers discovered something beyond their imagination. With the combined forces of their magical light, they pierced through their own dimension and found a new world in the form of a lost continent adorned with beautiful landscapes. However, this vast land was also populated with monsters, the likes of which the new explorers had never seen. A mighty battle commenced as the five spiritualists fought against this world's monsters in hopes of conquering their land. When the fight reached its peak, one of the spiritualists tapped into the deepest reaches of the magical light's power and ended the conflict with one massive wave of destruction. The strongest of the monsters were wiped out, but the land itself had been torn asunder. In the wake of the war, the once grounded continent became a floating archipelago of terrain, each piece held in the air by the light's lasting magic. The five spiritualists had conquered the now-splintered land of secrets, a land that they collectively named Tome. 
with a seemingly infinite amount of new knowledge it held. They traveled back to their original world, bringing with them their many disciples to help build a new populatable environment. As they continued to explore its locales, discovering more about the inner workings of its ecosystems, the five spiritualists each discovered their own ways of attaining eternal life. Chief Batopio became one with nature. Plant life and fungi grew upon him as he ruled the Adotis Woods. Queen Ruler Ruby gained infinite youth after consuming the potent gemstones of Morganite Valley. President Exec combined his magic with the ores of the land to convert himself into a metallic being, who then built Telluria City. Empress Kinder Spirit gave up her corporeal body and became an everlasting spirit of the volcanic Orange Island. The magical light that helped them conquer this land was utilized to further enchant the floating terrain with teleportation capabilities, the telepillars we have today. Thus, the Net of Light interconnected all four regions under the rule of the godly webmaster and the four neck kings. As time passed, Tome became a habitable land for the five conquerors and their followers, who wished to share this world and its magic with more people from their original world. And so the dimensional gates surrounding Tome were open to any and all that wished to cross its threshold. As the populace grew, and as one might expect, a struggle for power eventually broke out between the inhabitants of the four regions. Knowing the prevention of battle was impossible, the conquerors pooled their magic together to cast a massive spell upon Tome in its entirety. Any and all violent acts were to be executed within pocket dimensions enveloped by the Net of Light, which we know as the Battle Grids, in order to keep the bloodshed to a minimum. While four of the conquerors continued to rule over their respective regions, the godly webmaster rose to the skies above Tome, discovering another new land beyond the splintered continent. They continued their search for new knowledge and oversaw all the land from above the heavens. With more and more beings from other worlds entering Tome each passing year in search of knowledge, glory, friendship, power, and more. And we, of course, are among those many warriors adventuring upon these lands. The Campaign of Champions is a perfect opportunity with which to test our bravery to the Neck Kings and be rewarded for our great acts of heroism! Wow, did you memorize all of that? But of course, a good storyteller does not always require a script. With that, it is time to venture forth! Off we go!
against two. This will make for an exciting experiment. Outnumbered, but not outclassed. This knight's blade of cold steel shall freeze our enemies in their tracks. What say ye, Keeper of the Orb? Let out thine most aggressive catchphrase! Uh, here comes my butt! A valiant effort! Good back there!
Wow, 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 wow! It's Nyla in the scales! Oh, this knight's reputation precedes him! Hey, if we beat you, do we get famous? <gasps> Let's find out. Try, if thou dares. Thank you. 